Why being this character is one of the worst decisions you could ever make in a regular show. Born in the early 1800s, Balks, also known as Skips, would start working at the park in 1879. But years before this would go to classes at a school called Bennett High School. Soon we would find out that this is just one of the high schools Skips has attended as he's been kicked out of multiple high schools just for fighting. And because of this, he's warned by the principal of the high school that he would be kicked out if he would be caught fighting. Fast forward, Skips is given a tour of the school by his friend named Gareth, who we later know as Gary. And eventually, he was introduced to the Guardians of Eternal Youth. Followed by Clark Bain, a known bully around the school who would start bullying the Guardians. Of course, Skips being the person he is, he would start defending the Guardians. And right before they would fight, the principal would show up, resulting in them acting like they were friends, play fighting. Later that day, Skips would meet one of the most important girls of his life, Mona, during lunch, who was quick to express her interest in Skips. But soon after, Clark Bain would show up and challenge Skips to a fight, resulting to Mona storming off. Finally, when Skips was able to catch up to Mona, she would tell him she doesn't like men who fight. Skips would promise her that he wouldn't fight again. After this, Mona and Skips' bond every day would become stronger and stronger as they would fall more in love with each other, and we would even see Mona show Skips how to use a hammer, which would foreshadow on why Skips is so good at fixing things in the future. Sadly, behind the scenes, Skips couldn't keep his promise to Mona, and would agree to Gary to fight Clark Bean and defeat him in a fight. Fast forward, it's prom day, which is the same day Skips agreed to fight Clark Bain on. Mona would notice that Skips' energy is off and would ask him if everything is alright throughout the night, and Skips would tell her that everything is alright. But little did Skips know that Clark Bain was outside and becoming impatient, eventually resulting to him taking the fight to Skips. Eventually, Skips would get the okay from the principal to fight Clark Bain, but was sadly on the rope to losing the fight. All because he thinks he doesn't need the gloves to defeat Clark Bain. And eventually, in the sight of danger, Mona would save Skips from Clark Bain, resulting in a huge part of the ceiling falling on top of her. Soon after this, an angered Skips would finally put on the gloves to defeat Clark Bain with the outcome being Skips uppercutting Clark Bane so hard that he would be punched years away in space. After Skips would go to check on Mona to see if she's alright, sadly was greeted with the harsh truth that she didn't make it, as the debris crushed her upon impact. Years later, Skips would be called by the Guardians in preparation of Clark Bane's return, and of course Skips would take on the responsibility of fighting Clark Bane every time he comes back, especially because he feels like Mona's death is his fault. So Skips would become immortal and not be able to die by old age, and with the help of his job and his friends, Skips would be able to get over this heartbreak. But sadly, just like Mona, being an immortal means that you're gonna outlive the ones that you love.